Hello students, welcome once again. Now I am just going to discuss here the degenerate Fermi gas. So you are aware of the fact that when we discuss about the system of the fermions, when we consider the system of fermions and we are just going to consider them the degenerate here. So I will just tell you why it is said to be the degenerate one. So you are aware of the fact that if the, you could just say that average de Broglie wavelength is comparable to or much larger than the average particle distance such that their wave function overlaps and that this overlap can not be ignored and the system can no longer be treated classically and then it must be treated under quantum mechanical treatment or yeah, quantum you can just say mechanically so it is important yeah either you can just say that it is expected that systems at low temperature T it means that this value of beta which is 1 upon kt this value of beta must be high and then we just say them to be the degenerate here then we can just say that the system to be degenerate however a system at high you can just say temperature can be degenerate with a high this value of chemical potential mu for metals you can just take the case for metals the fermi temperature tf stands for the fermi temperature it is epsilon f upon k with k is here boltzmann constant this comes out to be approximately 10 to the power 5 kelvin you can just say it is very high temperature which is you can just say it is very much higher than our room temperature and the system in this case should be treated quantum mechanically you can just say so this is important aspect of how we are just considering the degenerate but uh, uh, fermion gas because at system low temperature this beta parameter will be high at the same time you can just say a system at high temperatures will be degenerate with a high value of this chemical potential mu as well for metals you can just say this fermi temperature is coming out to of the order of 10 to the power 5 Kelvin which is very much higher at um, compared to the room temperature and then the system will have to be treated as quantum mechanical approach we have to just apply for that's why you just have seen that the fermion gas with the help of fermions you just discuss conduction of electrons in the metals so it is very important aspect of you can just say the degenerate fermi gas so thanks for watching